Hi everyone, welcome to Toddler Tuesday. So glad you could join us again for our second virtual Toddler Tuesday. I'm here in the galleries at the Georgia Museum of Art and the inspiration for today's Toddler Tuesday is springtime and butterflies. In the spring, there are so many colors outside. There are all the different flowers blooming, all the different green leaves on the trees. And this painting behind me has lots of different colors too. And we're gonna talk about that painting after I read a book for story time. And after story time, I hope you can do the art activity. Instructions are on our website. It's a very easy activity you can do. And it's a butterfly activity. So uh, let's read the book. So the book that I have for us today is called Mix It Up. And it's by one of my favorite authors and artist. His name is Hervé Toulé. What are these colors that you see on the cover of this book? What is that color? Do you know what color that is? What about that color? What is that color? Oh my gosh, so many colors. It's that time again. Are you ready? Point at that gray spot. Point again to see what happens. Oh, there they are. But don't they seem a bit shy? Point at it again. Can you point at that dot? Point, point, point. Oh, here they come. But there are a few still missing. Try pointing just one more time. Oh, finally, they're all here. So now, hold your hand up in the air Close your eyes and count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, yes, you've got the magic touch. Let's mix it up. There's your handprint. With one finger, point at the blue and then point at the yellow. Say abracadabra. Oh, see, you made green. Now point at that red. Did you do it? Okay, you pointed at the red and then point at the blue. Done? Okay. <gasps> what color did you make? You made a beautiful purple. Now try pointing at that yellow right there. Yeah? Okay. And now point at the red. <gasps> Great! What color did we make there? Is that orange? Great. Now, can you remember all that? Let's have some fun. Do you wanna go on? Okay. I'm going to shake the book really hard. What do you think will happen? together. We made green. Now I'm going to tilt the book. What do you think will happen? <gasps> what color did we make? 
We made purple. I'm going to close the book and push down really hard so the colors squish together. You ready? Mm. <gasps> what color is that? Bravo. We're doing really good. Now point at the book. So point at the book and rub two colors together really hard. Imagine you're rubbing those colors really hard. What's going to happen? Oh, you made purple. You got it. And to turn all of those dots to green, what do you have to do? <gasps> yes! Good job! More? White makes colors lighter. Point at the white and then at your favorite color. So point at the white. Okay, now point at your favorite color. Let's see what happens. <gasps> you made it lighter. Good job. That's it. You got it. All done. Just one more thing. Place your hand up in the air and count to five. One, two, three, four, five. <gasps> you made all the different colors come back. Good job. On your own now, play, look, and mix it up. So now that we've read our story, remember how to mix colors because when you do the art activity for this Toddler Tuesday, you'll be mixing up some colors to make a butterfly. So let's talk about this work of art behind me. Let's take a closer look, okay? So that book that we just read had lots of colors in it and it talked about mixing colors. And this painting behind me has lots of colors in it too. The painting behind me shows a garden. What do you see when you look at that garden? Do you recognize anything in that garden? I see some flowers and I see a tree at the top. I see a building too. Maybe that's somebody's house. You know what loves gardens? Butterflies love flower gardens. Have you seen any butterflies lately? Butterflies hatch in warm weather and love the spring. They love it because the weather feels so good and lots of flowers are blooming. What do you think the weather is like in this painting? Do you think a butterfly would like to live in that garden? Why or why not? Maybe talk to somebody you were with about what you think. After you talk about this painting, and if the weather is nice, try to find a butterfly outside. If you find one, notice what color it is, and if it is big or small. And when you come back inside, maybe you can do the art activity. It starts with a plain butterfly, and then you make it beautiful and colorful with your own paint. Bye everybody. Thanks for coming to Toddler Tuesday. See you next time.